Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Diana here, Lady Dice Crafty Creations. I just have today a um, project shares to share with you and a super cute birthday card from Thelma Hall. Thelma, thank you so much for this cute little card. Um, I don't even know what to say. I owe her a swap. It's sitting in a box already with her name and everything on it. It just needs to be sent. And of course, I haven't been out driving. My poor car is just sitting out there dealing with this eye thing. And I really got into this funky, weird, I don't know. This summer was just totally strange for me. I don't know what was going on with me. But anywho, I am back in my craft room. So I am hoping, Selma, if you're watching this, to get that um, parcel out to you. It's going to be just a tad late. But... Uh, Hopefully, yes. Um, anyways, I got to show you the super cute card that she made for me for my birthday. Absolutely love it. It's super cute. Look at this. I love it. It's so cute to celebrate. Have a sweet day and two cupcakes, some cherries and a strawberry. Absolutely love it. And then inside the card, she's just got happy birthday, Diana. Hope you have a great day with family. My birthday is not till Monday, so it just got here in time. Thanks. Um, I'm looking where I lost here with family and friends. And friends, did you send? <laughs> did you send your swap to me? Uh, no, I didn't receive it. I know because it's still sitting on my counter where it should be. It should be at your house. Uh, she tried to leave me a message on YouTube, and I did finally see that because I wasn't even really looking at my messages um and and also she said she sent me one I think too on my she didn't say it in here but I think when I read the one that she sent it into my hotmail and I, didn't, I couldn't find it so I don't know maybe I accidentally deleted it who knows what I did uh she, I sent you an email yeah this says here lol have a great day and happy happy Halloween to Thelma Hall. So super cute. Thank you so much, Thelma. And on the back here, she's got Thelma Hall 2023. Absolutely love it. It's super cute. Thank you so much for thinking of me. Yet we're a year younger, right? <laughs> You're younger? Unfortunately, it's a year older. Anyways, um, I think I will share this one with you first. It's... um. You see me make these before. I don't think I've shared this. I should have actually checked back on my uh, videos, but I don't think I've shared this one with you. I don't think. Oh, who knows? Maybe I did. <laughs> Anyways, we'll go through it. But it's um, got this off of Christine's Crafty Adventures. She called it this a couple of years ago now. Rachel's Caddy. I've made a few of these, actually. This one I did in Mickey Mouse. Oops, I just knocked at the card there. Um, and I think it turned out super cute. I really, really like the way it turned out. Um, for some reason, I'm going to say I did share this with you. Oh, well, we'll quickly go through it. So, yeah, just on the side here, it comes like with four places slots. It comes with a little drawer here. And, uh, yeah, I just, I love the way these always turn out. I did actually a couple for the grandkids, and I think I've made a couple and sold them. This one I will have up for sale, too. So, I just made a Mickey Mouse wand. I just uh, cut out the circles, stuck the ears, made this bow. Actually, it's a Minnie Mouse wand, right? And then I just had these ribbons and um, in these, what are these called again? <laughs> yeah, we're on video. Uh, yeah, and just stuck it on a yellow straw. And I thought that turned out cute. And there's the back, the front. So, we made that. And then we'll start with the front here made a couple of um paper clips me the black one and made this pink one i had these stickers in my stash so let's put those on paper clips made this little booklet um i'm not sure if i'm gonna put beads on this or not um kind of hmm, don't know what i should do with that you know what this reminds me that i've already shared this with you then because it Seems I've said that to you. What should I do? Anyways, we'll quickly go through it. It says, best day ever. And in here, it's just um, where you can put some pictures and uh, some white paper. 
do some notes with your pictures. Yeah, it's just a cute little um like album I did, right? And uh, just tied it in with a uh, string. So if you want to take the this out, you can. And there's that, the white, there's another one, the white paper. That, and then there's this here with the castle. Yeah, so I thought that turned out cute. And then I just put these in um, that were with the kit. Pack your bags for a great adventure. This one with the balloon. And then this one with the castle. So that, and then I had, had the paper clip on that. And then I just stuck in a, packed up some of these cut aparts. Make your own magic. I'm not going to open them. Had some stickers. So threw in a whack of stickers in there. And then same with this one here. Same thing. Magic. Wish upon a star. Most of me. Happy to place dream. Smiles from ear to ear. Adventure. Yeah, and there's a few of them in there. Some cut aparts in there. So did that. And then... We did this little one here. It says everyone say, say cheese. And yeah, it's just, um, it feels like I did this on chipboard, but I didn't. It sure turned out solid and it's, I just glued it. This is our favorite thing, thing. And then you can put a couple pictures. Yeah, just like a little booklet there. Did that. And then I just, uh, did a, um, Bookmarker for actually the little traveler's notebook, but I just put it in the back there. Best day ever, laminated it, and then stuck some washi tape in the back here in the little pocket. Yeah. And then these three little booklets, and then this one in the front here just said you and me, and they're just filled with um, white paper that you can do some doodling in there or writing down for your holiday or in Disneyland or yeah. Another one. This one has the Frontier Adventure and Magic Wonder. And this one says Believe, and there's Mini, and it says Magic. And then again, just has the white paper. So that's those. Let's put them back in here. Then, let's put this stuff back in. It's kind of out of the way for now. We'll organize it a little bit better later. And then I had made this um, little book from way back. Um, little Traveler's Notebook. I just uh, made it a little more thicker. And uh, I made a little charm. It seems to me I did this. <laughs> I don't know. I'm really sorry if I've already shared this with you. I really should have looked before I shared and you, there's a Minnie Mouse um, charm, just like red beads, some blue and uh, red beads there. And this one has the black and white beads. And then this one at the end here has a little key that has Minnie Mouse or Mickey Mouse on there. A little bow. Another, again, of Mickey. This one's Mickey in his pants. And then there's the hand. And then I just stuck a tassel so it hangs off of, um, I love this. I actually was thinking of keeping this for myself, but I'm not going to. <laughs> I am going to make myself a new one, though, because Callie had sent me some cute little charms for Mickey. So, anyway, so we just opened this up. It has Mickey Mouse on the top there. This is that vinyl that I got from... Oh, AliExpress, I do believe. Yes, like a long time ago. And the first booklet here just has where you can just document, you know, this white paper at the beginning here. Then it has your calendar. It's not dated, so you can put what month and what you would like. And in the back here, just more white paper. Put notes. These are also laminated. And this one here is just a pocket. If we can... Hang on. <laughs> Uh, pocket and I think it opens on the top yes and I just stuck in a card from the paper pad and then this next insert has it's also laminated some again some uh, oh no it doesn't have white paper and this is um, your day-to-day -day 
that one was your monthly, the one in the beginning, and this one is called your, I can't remember what it's called. <laughs> oh, and anyways, you have that one, and there's the back of that booklet, and here's the other um, part of the, the um, pocket. As I just put that in it there, our favorite thing. And then this here is a folder, has some Mickey Mouse uh, stickers that came with the kit. Same here, same with over here. And it comes with this little um, pen, red pen with a clip. And then the last one here is just, I threw in one of these little, um, little booklets that just had the lined paper and then just covered it. Well, actually, this was already there, but then I just covered the booklet and just stuck it in there. So it did become kind of thick, but that's okay. Anyway, so I did that, and I do believe that was it for that. And I just stuck it, I think, in this, this one here. And I just put this in the back. And then we'll put that there. And then we'll put the wand back here. I love this wand. That turned out super cute. <laughs> Me and my Mickey Mouse, hey? Me and my Mickey. Anyways, so that is that. Um, so the next thing that I just want to share is I ended up making those little stockings. And I think they turned out super cute. The first one here is Baby's First Christmas. I made put out the stockings. I cut them out, sewed them around, cut the white, stuck a little hoop. For the Baby's First Christmas, I was just going to leave it like that. And then I found I had, um, when I made diaper cakes, I had a face cloth. So face cloth, so I stuck a face cloth on top and orange spoon. But you know what? I didn't have no other. only had, I didn't even have a pink one. It's just like, well, this is like a reddish gas color but yeah but anyways I did the baby's first Christmas in the iron on vinyl and what I'll do is when I put them up for sale they want me to put their names I will and there's this one here another pink one says baby's first Christmas with the orange spoon same thing with the the um face cloth and sorry about the crinkling and this one here I actually had a blue spoon so baby's first Christmas I love the gold on the blue and then the face cloth in there. Then uh, we did the um, Christmas, Merry Christmas. And I see that it slid down. The hot chocolate packs are in here with the candy cane to bring it up a little bit. And, uh, of course, I sewed it, cut them all out, sewed them. Yeah, I had a lot of fun making these again. I just hope they will sell. And then this one says, baby, it's cold outside, again, with the candy cane. And I did back it up with some paper. And then there's this one. It says, baby, it's cold outside. This one says, Christmas, Christmas movies and hot chocolate. And then I did this one here. I love this gold glitter. I just love it. The green with the gold, too. And this one says, Merry Christmas. This one, I did this in um, this color. I had the, this kind of felt. But I thought, you know what? Why not? I love this saying, naughty is new nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then this one here, but first hot chocolate. I First when I, this, I was tired by this time. By the time I came around to doing this one on the Cricut, I cut it out too big. And so then I'm like, what am I going to do? So I ended up cutting because the way it fit on there, it just looked ridiculous. So I ended up cutting them up and then just put butt first hot chocolate. And it still looks too big on there, but you know what? Oh, well. So I got to say, well, it looks cute. Cute. Did you love that word? That's my word. It looks cute. I got it because it was cute. <laughs> so there was that. And then I started working on this here. From Christine's Crafty Adventures, um, I'm going to say this is a few months ago that she put this out on Instagram. Her and her girlfriend did a video on Instagram. But it was turning out really cute until I noticed 
Look how it's like a little purse, eh? It's a little purse with a little traveler's notebook. I haven't finished it off yet, and I don't even know if I'm going to. Because I noticed, which is really weird, um, look at it, it's coming apart. The paper is coming out from the laminator, and I laminated this twice because I knew that I was going to be folding it. See, on here too, right where the folds were. And it's not like it was, because um, it was single-sided paper, so what I did is I put paper inside it, eh? but I didn't, it's not like it's doubled inside either. Like it's in between the um, score line. So really weird how that, I've never had that happen. Never. And see, on, even on the, where I put the handle, all along here, as soon as I started putting the handle in, it's, yeah, I've never had this happen. So I was making this to sell it, but not so much now. So I think either if I do finish it, I will, I will uh, keep it for myself and, you know, yeah. So on the front here, put Hello Christmas, and I can't remember what paper pad this one was. It was a couple years ago. Hmm, can't remember. And, uh, yeah, so then you have the girl and the little doggy there, and, yeah, then I just made a couple of paper clips right in here. There's another place where you can put paper clips, and I put one down here. And I had this little clip with the bell, so I just threw that on there for now. And I, yeah, still need to decorate on the front here. But then these got um, this white paper in them. And then this has got a folder. I haven't laminated it yet. I don't know if I will. And then there, still have to decorate there. And this one with the white paper. And then there's the back. Yeah, this one is, see, this one did it too. I was going to say this one's okay. Yeah, look at. So I'm wondering if it's my laminator. Either that. Or I didn't wait long. Yeah, but then the green light was on when I threw it through. Strange. It's just a weird. I haven't used my laminator in so long, so maybe that's why. I don't know. Weird, eh? I've never, never had this happen. Anyways, so that was that share. So I don't know if I'll actually finish it off. But it. I thought it would have... It was turning out really cute. That's my cute word. I love the handle. Purse. Yeah, anywho. Thought I'd share that. Anyways, um, yeah, that's it. All my project shares, what I've been doing, what I've been working on, and sharing that super cute happy mail card from Thelma. Again, thank you, Thelma, for thinking of me. And uh yeah. So I hope everybody is doing uh, great and getting into that crafting mode because I'm finally getting into it again. <laughs> and I uh, hope everybody's uh, doing good. So until the next video, thanks again, you guys, for tuning in and watching my video. If you like it, please give me a thumbs up. And I would love it if you're new here to subscribe to my channel. And yeah, and I'm trying my best here to finally get videos back out there again. So we'll see you in my next video. Thanks, you guys. Bye.